So we are fellow messengers, Pepper Stevens and Nick Streva interviewing Stephen Durham uh, for his 2012 presidential campaign as a freedom socialist, which what we meant to ask you was, I've noticed this a lot in class, I've noticed this a lot everywhere, everyone says Obama's a socialist, we have to get him out, but I don't think people really know what socialism is, so could you give like a brief description on what socialism really is? Yes, I'm running for president, my name is Stephen Durham, and I'm running with Cristina Lopez, she's the vice presidential candidate, and I'm here in Poughkeepsie, and yes, I can answer your question, the um, socialism is a not-for-profit, economic system whose purpose is to meet the needs of all, the human needs of all. And that's what socialism is. And socialism is a possibility because capitalism has developed technology to such a point that we really could provide enough for everybody. So that's a simple but that's a really accurate definition of socialism and that's the one that I've used in the campaign. Another aspect of socialism though is that you have to have workers democracy. And workers, and workers' democracy means that workers and consumers coming together make decisions about what happens, happens in the economic, in the economic and the political sphere. So the conditions of people's lives are decided collectively by workers and consumers coming together in workplace, in neighborhood, in regional and ultimately, since it's a globalized economy, and in international assemblies. So those are the two, those are the, that's the definition of socialism. And I think a lot of people are afraid of socialism because the media in this country and the ruling class, the corporations, are in the business of misrepresenting socialism. So just the final follow-up question, when people say that President Obama is indeed a they say he's a socialist, he's a communist, this, this and that. From what you're saying, they're mistaken. He's more of a corporate capitalist. Is that kind of along the lines of what he's you're He's definitely to? a corporate capitalist. But he's a corporate capitalist that will say that we need to have full employment. He'll say we need to have full employment. Or he says that he wants to provide a safety net for people. But his record in the past four years has been not to do it. So to the people who are calling him a socialist, anybody who says that we need full employment, anybody that says that we need decent health care, anybody that says we need education that's free and a quality education, those people are saying that that's sort of socialist ideas. And indeed they are socialist ideas. But it's one thing to say it, it's another thing to make the fundamental changes to make it happen. And that will happen under socialism. The people that are criticizing Obama are basically criticizing people who defend what the working class has gained. Not what Obama has gained, but what we've gained. What we've gained as workers and as students and as, and as immigrants in this country to make our lives better because it's being eroded. All right, well, thank you for your time and good luck on your campaign. <laughs>